Aloha from Maui. I'm Kelly Yates. Welcome to Lady Etiquette Channel. Have you ever wondered what the etiquette is while staying on a resort? I'm going to give you some tips to remain elegant while on vacation and avoid any social blunders. When sharing a community pool, do be mindful of other guests using the pool by keeping a safe distance when swimming to avoid splashing anyone. When entering the swimming pool, avoid jumping in and splashing people enjoying the sun. Do enter from the steps. It is much safer and you are less likely to slip up this way. If you are using a pool floaty, don't take more than one because this will take up a lot of space in the swimming pool. Do be mindful of other guests by taking one floaty at a time and only if there is plenty of space for the floaty. Music is a very personal choice. Just because you enjoy listening to your favorite singer does not mean that everybody else at the swimming pool or the beach enjoy it as much as you. Do keep the volume at a low pace and be mindful of other people enjoying their social environment. If you place a towel on the beach and other people are next to you, avoid lifting or folding the towel up, which will flick sand on people enjoying the sun. Do be cognizant of the people around you. The best strategy I find is by gently rolling the towel into a ball away from the direction of people, which will not create a sandstorm. Then carry your towel at least 10 feet away to shake the sand off and then fold away into your bag. Incidentally, do avoid walking too close to people along the beach, as this can also flick sand on people. The blazing sun rays often can make people feel more relaxed, lazy, and forgetful of their deportment. If you decide to get up and go for lunch or a beverage, don't walk over in your bikini or speedos. Do cover up when entering any dining area. Unless it's a tiki bar on the beach and you are leaving immediately. However, if you plan on enjoying your cocktail at the tiki bar, do cover up while sitting on the chair. This is also for hygiene reasons. If you are not heading to the ocean and plan on taking a long stroll along the beach, do cover up and keep it modest. If you are not renting a sun lounger and using a community sun lounger, do remember it is not your personal possession. It is not polite to place your belongings on the sun lounger and then suddenly take leave for lunch. Unless you are going to the pool or the beach briefly, or perhaps a short walk, do avoid reserving your sun lounger and be mindful of other guests needing the sun lounger. Before entering the swimming pool, do remember to take a quick shower to remove any creams or chemicals before entering the swimming pool. Incidentally, when exiting the swimming pool, take a quick shower again to remove the chlorine, which can be quite drying on the skin. If you have taken a dip in the ocean or the swimming pool, do remember to dry yourself off properly so you don't leave a trail of water going everywhere especially when going up the steps, which can be quite slippery for other people going up the steps after you. Do keep your voice at an acceptable volume so people around you will not be privy to your conversation. Do avoid screaming, especially when entering the water. I do hope you enjoyed this video. Please do like, comment and subscribe to Lady Etiquette. I can also be found on Instagram at the Lady Etiquette or at ladyetiquette.com. Now remember, dear ladies and gentlemen, always be gracious and confident. Till the next time. Bye.